I think to be Jewish, you need to have a synagogue that you can go to, relate to, meet people, and be able to practice your religion. For me, the most rewarding thing with Temple Shalom has been the changes that we've been able to do as a group, as a committee, interior committee, in the sanctuary, in the social hall, and when you're there, to hear people smile, notice the change, talk about it, and hear what they say, and watch them acknowledge the changes that were done. Everything from the Bemis uh, stone around the ark, to the yard side panel changes, to the lighting, to the fabric for the chairs, all of that as part of a group working effort and hearing the people's comments on that. I will do anything to get him out of the house. So if it's devote his time and whatever, that's fine with me. <laughs>Several months ago, Daryl Sisman, the president of the temple, oh, yes. baked a challah for me. And not, only that, wait, and not only that, but brought it over <laughs> to, our home. to our house on a Sabbath to enjoy. And was, in my whole so life, wonderful. I've never, in any temples I've belonged to, no. never had a president do that for me. And yeah. this was I was think a about it all the experience. time. It's just a wonderful yes. gift. I think the key to a lot of it is, if you like the place you're going to, if you like the synagogue, you enjoy meeting people, you enjoy socializing, then you need to become part of it somehow, some way. There's always places here that you can donate time for all kinds of things, whatever your career, skills, knowledge is. Even if you don't have the funds, donating time is as equally as important. I guess we would, we would hope that others would get the same pleasure and satisfaction that we have gotten from contributing to Temple Shalom and helping the congregation to continue to be a welcoming and beautiful place to call your Jewish home as well.